Hey guys, I'm Avail back again with another video on this Galaxy M21. In this video, let's do a battery charging test of this device using this stock charger that we get inside the box with this device. Now, we'll see how long will it take to fully charge this device with 6000 mAh battery. And after this video, what I'll do in my next videos, I'll try to cover everything regarding the battery backup, whether it is videos, cameras, you know, anything that we do, how long will it last okay now before we start if you're new to my channel to watch more videos do subscribe and do share your opinions in the comments so let's get started now here you can see that uh, it is totally drained to zero if i try to turn it on it's not happening so let's do one thing let's connect the charger now you can see that i'm using the charger that we get inside the box that is the stock charger here okay now let's connect the cable usb type c Okay, now let's do one thing. Let's start the stopwatch so that we can keep a track of the time. Exactly, how long will it take? Let's turn this on. Yes, done. Now let's see how long will it take to get to one person. Now one thing I would like to tell you here is that this device gives you a two to three minutes of screen on time, even if at zero person. Suppose if you have drained it totally to zero, you know completely drained still it will give you two to three minutes of screen on time so that's really good here you can see that still it is at zero so we'll see how long will it take it yeah to get it to one person 36 seconds 37 seconds it should take some time because as i said at zero person as well it gives you some screen on time two to three minutes so let's do one thing we'll turn this on by pressing the power button yeah and if you're using this device do let me know comments that how good is it in terms of battery backup or gaming cameras do share your opinions in the comments okay and if you are facing any problems then also do let me in the comments now I'll just wait for a few seconds so that I can show you that yes it is almost one minute 15 seconds here you can see that it is actually zero let me show you that again yeah let me show you that just wait for a few seconds here you can see that it is zero so what i am going to do now i'll be back after 30 minutes you see that we have crossed uh, 34 minutes now the battery level is at 18 percent so according to me it is slow but yes we have considered that it has 6000 mAh battery so it will take some time here again you can see that it is at 18 percent we have completed 100 minutes now let me show you the percentage here now you can see that it is at 53 percent now let me tell you one thing even if you turn on the screen it does show that it is charging fast let me show you this yes here you can see that now it has reached 54 percent we have just crossed uh, 2 hours 42 minutes and you can see that we have reached uh, 86% so it means it will take more than 3 hours. So guys you can see that we just completed 3 hours and the charging is at 95% that means it will take more than 3 hours. So guys uh, it is finally done now you can see that it is fully charged it took around 3 hours 16 to 17 minutes in order to get fully charged. So according to me the charging speed is a bit slow but if you consider the battery size it's okay because if you are not a very heavy user even if you charge it up to 70 60 70 percent you can get a full day backup from this device this is what I can tell you from my own, you know, own uh, initial experience obviously in my next video I'll be telling you in detail about the battery performance of this device whether it is in terms of gaming uh, browsing or you know uh, any other <laughs> tasks that we do right so do watch that video now uh, as i said the charging speed is slow but considering the battery size it's okay it's not that slow now another thing that i would like to tell you here do not go for any other charger because they might have actually or i can say that samsung have optimized this charger for this device so if you go for any other charger that can be uh, give you can give you more output than this maybe 18 watt or 30 watts or whatever it is but there won't be any significant difference and what i can do 
I'll try to charge it with the 18 watt charger that I have and if I find any you know significant difference then I do let you know in the comments okay so uh, I hope that this video will give you some idea about the charging speed of this device and if it does then do let me know in the comments and if you end up liking this video uh, to watch more videos do subscribe to my channel and do share your opinions in the comments so till the next video guys cheers